Greetings, sir and sirettes, and welcome back to a new season of Reassembly with me, Lafrix. Your votes have been counted, and I'm sure verified by the um, straw poll, and the B faction has won by an amazing margin. So today, sir and sirettes, we begin the B Thrix Empire, and yes, you all knew I was going to say that. You see, this time I'm very tempted just to keep the traditional colours. I I, I, very, I very much like it with the yellow and the um, and the grey. However, I am tempted to make it a bit darker, not by much, because because if I make it too dark, it'll blend in with the background, then you'll lose all the edges. Or I could. Uh, see, I, I want to make it a bit more bee-like, so I'm thinking like a, perhaps a really dark red. Although of course, I, what I really want is a very dark grey. But that's not really possible for the reasons I've just explained, because these outlines don't always show properly when it comes to the ship. So I'm thinking I'm going to do is something like this. So I'm just darkening it a little bit and making it a bit less towards the red, even though I just said more towards the red by mistake. So that's kind of what I'm going to go with. Uh, yeah, I think, honestly, if you're going to play the B race, the B, yeah, I, I'm assuming it's races now with the names. Um, it hints more towards races than factions. I think that you need to be yellow and black to honor the bees. So let's get started, shall we launch? Now this is a faction I have absolutely no experience with, similar to the red faction. Um, I simply have not played this one before. Okay, so we start off with lasers. I didn't actually know that. I thought we started off with them um, daka 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 guns, aka machine guns, but apparently not. A root. Yep, well now that works. I could turn them off, but I forgot. Wow, look how weird that, a shard cluster. Look, wow, so much stuff with this one. Okay, I'm already very happy. A laser drone launcher. Well, hopefully it's better than the laser drones from the red faction. A PD subsystem, and another PD subsystem which is bigger. Um, not the best range in the world, but they shoot quickly-ish with good-ish damage, so it's a matter of... Oh, they're ridiculously cheap um, P-wise. That's why the ship resource is almost none. What's with the route? Why is this... And it's free of charge, so I don't understand quite why that wasn't already there. Heavy body... Oh, that's nice. So you get two different versions of every piece of armor. Oh, that's fantastic. So you could choose to build either a very, very heavy ship or a bit of a lighter ship or a mix with them. Okay. Quantum Doom Beam. Oh, I, I already have. Do I? So I do. That just looks really big, and I assumed it wasn't unlocked. A bigger version of the Shard Launcher and another route. That's weird, so I guess was meant to be unlocked, maybe it's a bug, I don't know, could be anything. So it's just a piece of armour then, it's nothing special, okay. So we have the Quantum Doom Beam and the Quantum Doom Beam bigger. So what are we currently? Let's have a look, we're currently the Bat. Wow, look how many ships we have to choose from. Okay, let's, uh, shall we be special and choose a different ship to start off with? What's this one like? You've got the PD subsystems. And then two of the Quantum Doom Beams, the smaller variation. Okay, that takes a lot of energy. How much energy are we, are we, are we producing? Holy crud! 4,000 energy per second! That is a very, very powerful um, command core. What about you? Is there any generator upgrade we can even purchase? There, there you go, generator slash storage is a massive thing. Look at that, 2,700 credits to unlock. Okay, this, honestly, from first impressions, this looks really cool. Okay, so what I think I should do is just get used to the ship for a while, so I'm going to just play around with it as it is, and we'll see how I like the weapons. So this has two of the bigger quantum doom beams, and then two of the smaller, okay. I was told as well, uh, yet yeah, I should turn it off. Next time, I promise, the next time I do a, the next race, I will turn them off. I was told as well the thrusters are a bit overpowered. Uh, let's have a look at the thruster. 8k thruster 5. Oh, yeah, that is actually quite good for the size. In particular for the size. Yeah, okay. And also explains why I'm so fast. Okay, so it has very good guns. Oh, of course, we're the, um... I guess we're the hive faction, aren't we, with the cities? How much, um pushback does this laser have? Absolutely none. Okay. I always thought lasers had a little bit. Oh look, it's a little high. That's really cool. I didn't actually know you actually had the buildings in this faction. I thought you... Although they are the building faction, I didn't think you actually had them. Maybe that's how it used to be a long time ago. Perhaps I'm going insane. Wee! I kind of touched him with a laser for half a second. Wow, this thing is so twitchy. It's going to be very difficult to use to. Let's go against this really, really obviously strong enemy. And win! 
Okay, so the lasers are very powerful. Ah, I'm not too strong because I'm tiny. Oh, come on. Okay, how fast do I regen? So much slower than the red faction, but saying that, that is kind of the red faction's thing. Low armor, but really, really faster regen. Hello, red faction, how are you? Damn, that laser's nasty, though. A bit short range, but hello, I'm definitely going to die here because you're way too big for me to fight. <laughs> Aha, the core is surviving. It's so good I've got little thrusters on there. Wow, survived two situations, which honestly I should have died. Oh, will the third get me? Nope. Come on, I just want to get to a nice um, damage station that isn't... Oh, being attacked by scythes. Oh, come on, that's not fair. You meanie head. Oh, my beautiful resource. Ah, the first death already in the first five minutes of play. Of course it is. Of course it is. I mean, how else would you have life if not for death? Hello. Excuse me. Yep, okay, I'm just going to sneak in here and try to grab this, and I'll run away like a little coward. Yay, cowardess. Oh, my lord, there are enemies everywhere. I wonder if there's perhaps a longer range version of this weapon. It's weird because it's not on a, um, what do you, oh, there's a word I'm looking for here. It's not on a turret piece, it's a, f damn, they get broken so easily. They, I, I need to armor them up. I think this whole thing is a little bit frail. Well, actually, looking at it now, yeah, it is. I mean, look at the pieces. Oh, that's a really weird armor piece in terms of its shape. But yeah, everything's kind of connected by, by like, one piece, so if, if one thing gets destroyed, I lose chunks. Of course, though, we are currently the starter ship, so naturally we are being killed by everything. Die, fiend! Oh! Almost killed a much larger ship than ourselves, but of course, it, that is the red faction. We are the bees. Okay, let's increase our um, ship resource a little bit, shall we? Um, do I want to see what the shard launcher is like? You know, I kind of do. I really kind of do. Um, so... How do I attach this? How, w what piece is actually... The oh, they are the shards. Okay, I thought they were part of the structure. Oh, of course it's shard launcher, isn't it? Of course they are the shards. Only makes sense. Ah, if I do it there, though, I don't get both of the, the shots. So what I have to do is this. Okay, yeah, then I'll do the same on the other side. Okay. So we'll just move the thruster around. So that's a maneuver... A, yeah, a maneuver thruster. Highly responsive, low impulse. Okay. Okay, it's got a whole new set, like a whole new thing for me to kind of discover and explore, which is kind of awesome, honestly. I do love it when a game kind of throws some new mechanics. Oh, it's not weirdly shaped, it's just how they've placed together because of the lion's um, vanish. Hmm. Aha! Bigger! Wow, well, that's 2,000 health, that's not bad. Okay, I reckon we continue for a little bit longer and then. I'll consider making a brand new ship of my own. A ship to cl oh, that's, uh, those two are getting in the way, that's annoying. That is in annoying indeed. Okay, you go back for a second. Ah, uh, yeah, I think I think this is what it's just one of those designs which would be a, I wouldn't say impossible obviously, but um it's just a little bit difficult to work with because of how it's been put together. So it'd be a lot easier for me to just, you know, make a brand new design. So I think that's exactly what I'm going to do as soon as I'm done with this. Can I put one there? Oh, I can. Excellent. It's always nice when you're not expecting something to work and it does actually work. Oh, so the root's like a, like a pillar. That's kind of cool. But why can't I attach it there? Okay, so the root's something special. Look, it won't attach to anything. What is special with the root section? You can. Eh? Why can't I attach? Does it not have connection points at the end? Oh, it doesn't have connection points on the end. Okay, so that's what it is. I thought it just wasn't connecting, but no, it has no connection points on the end. That's bizarre. I wonder how these things... Oh, these are mines. Okay. But honestly, I kind of just wanted to try out some of these. Auto firing projectiles, a range of only 600, but I don't currently have any point defense, so I kind of want it, honestly. Excellent, we can put that there, and that way we're not losing too much of our maneuverability from this segment. Excellent. And then let's just. Because uh, I've just lost a couple of thrusters there, to put them here. For station removement, more so than anything else, and. Wow, that fits so perfectly. Oh, it's too small. That'd have been that'd have been amazing if that would have fit then. That would have been absolutely phenomenal. 
I don't know why, but I kind of like how that looks. Is there a smaller thruster, perhaps, like that? Yay! My exact, my exact ship resource. Okay, so, let's just load in. Now, I assume these are going to be right mouse, okay, and then they're all on point defense, okay. Oh, I did have some point defense, didn't I? Okay, um, ignore me, I'm going insane. Wow, those things go miles. Are they actually on a turret, though, or is it always when I'm f where I'm facing? Let's just go on the keyboard. Okay, so like the lies, wow, that, they reload really fast. Hmm. Okay, curious to see how good they are. I like how they kind of come out to the sides. Also, they look really cool. You know? No. Just no. I don't really want to get, get into that. Ow. Okay. Oh, yeah, speaking of, 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 the, of the laser drones, I actually watched... Um, I've, I've been watching a few tournaments recently from several YouTubers. I may put a link in, in the description to one of them because, honestly, there is a... I uh, can't... I'm so sorry. I can't re remember his name right now. I'll try to remember for the next episode. But, um... It's rare that I try and I just randomly give a shout out or promote on the channel for no reason other than oh my god they they deserve more of a look in but honestly the quality of the videos on the channel is ridiculously good and he's so much smaller than me and I, 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 that boggles my mind so I will be I'll be I'll be posting a link to that so if you like reassembly really give the link a look it's a tournament with the last faction we played the red fac the red faction but there's m multiple tournaments there the tournaments I actually um currently getting really into um i anyone who's well, any, any, any uh, sorry my stamina's a bit bad right now i'm still very ill <laughs> this is all stock footage i'm i'm i'm, I'm trying to record while i'm heavily ill and, and under medication damn that thing's shield oh yeah do we have shields we do have shields why don't i have shields i bet i've missed them or something that's so stupid i was just i was just thinking how do i defend the ship i've been playing the red faction too much also also i haven't hit hit anything yet with my um, little side explosive things I'm starting to hate you. I hate you a lot more. And now I've lost my complete train of thought. Um, yeah, tour yeah, tournaments. I'm not a particularly competitive person. But recently, I've been getting rather into the whole tournament idea, and I think it looks really cool. Um, I don't think I'll be getting into one myself particularly, but um, really, really cool concept. Uh, I, th I think it's a game that does really well with, with competitive play, and I love the amount of imagination that goes into certain builds. Is that the only shield we have? Am I blocked? Okay, last time I said something like this. Oh, I wish it was a smaller version. There's one right next to it and I missed it. Okay, we can't scroll up and down. That much is true. This is an R capacity booster, which is awesome and always needed later on. But there's nothing else I can see? Question mark? Okay. Okay. Although, I am tempted to do something. Since uh, I think this will be the last time I use the ship now, the next time I go into the garage, uh, the garage, the bay, the hangar, whatever, whatever you want to call this, I will be deleting the ship and making a new one. I want to test out just how good these shards can be, possibly actually hitting something <laughs> in the pro That can't be a functional thing, because that gets through. So, what, do I throw the shard launcher every time I shoot it? Now, this is... How are you meant to place these? It looks like if it's on a straight line. So that should work. So I guess you'd have to kind of make like a straight line to hold them. If you wanted to fire forward, that is, of course. Hmm. So you see, that's, why I, that's one of the reasons why these weapons make me feel very, very curious. Because it feels like, oh, you could have like a scatter shot weapon. I'm, I'm always a big fan of things like that. Oh. This is bizarre. How this tries to get placed. So it's... It's the edges that allow it to happen sometimes. So really, these go... Can I mirror this so it has its shards on different... Oh, but you, you can't, really? You can't mirror this? It says it's mirrored now, but no, it doesn't mirror. So it always looks like... That's a bit of a shame. And very bizarre. Maybe there is a way. Obviously, if I just twist it round... It'll just do that, which isn't really worth anything to us. And also, of course, it'll be facing the wrong way. In fact, that's, that, that's what's got the little arrow on it. Hmm. That's a curious one. Maybe I'll build a um, asymmetrical ship. I mean, I mean, I always end up doing it anyway. But um, a purposeful asymmetrical ship. In fact, I think I will end up doing that. So that does work. Why does that work? I'm very confuzzled right now to how the shard launcher actually allows or disallows positioning because on this side if I were to try to place it like this only one of the shards 
What? But now it's doing both? I'm... Okay. Okay then. I mean, it's good it does do that, because that makes it easier for me to use. It's just a weird thing. I'm not sure if they actually will work in practice, though, or if it's just a kind of graphical glitch right now it's allowing it. I guess it's one of those we'll have to just try and find out sort of dealios. Hmm. So it says impulse, then there's maneuver. Highly responsive, low impulse, and high impulse. Oh, I see. Okay. I'm getting there, I'm getting there. So I just, want to, just kind of want to see how these do, honestly. They don't seem to be that great, but it'd be lovely if they were. It would be very lovely indeed. Why can you place things on the thing you're about to throw? That makes no sense to me. Ah, nothing makes sense to me anyway. It's not like it's a, it's a new thing. And I guess this can't go here, though, because of the shard in the way. Can I put this here now? And the shard can go there! Okay, so I, I'm assuming that's incorrect. So let's just load, load it in let's have a quick look-see, shall we? Oh, for Peter! Come on, I'm still- Ah! 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 Bad! This didn't go well at all! This did not go well! Go away, you stupid little drones. Yep. 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 Those drones, by the way, I still think they're rubbish, but when they're massed, it seems like they can actually do something. And that's what got me onto the topic with the whole tournament thing, anyway. Fire away! Wow! Took a chunk out of him. Of course, I can't survive the freaking backlash of him fighting back, but, you know, it was cool nonetheless. <laughs> There's two huge ships just eating me every time I spawn in. Welcome back to life. Here is your free death. I want revenge. I need revenge. Also, I've, I've, I've um, screwed up thrusters. So, do they come back? Okay, yes, they do. Also, these things reload really quickly. Let's look at that. I'm just spreading them everywhere. It's like explosives here, a few explosives there. And they're already damaged. It, I, 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 really, I really need to put the weapons behind a bit of armor. Ow. That's like a sniper. Ah! I lost ch What's firing at me? Why is nothing going to plan right now? Ah. Uh. Yes! That was just um, a volley of those mines at close range. Sorry, shards. They're called shards, aren't they? I mean, they certainly look like shards, and I was calling them shards a second ago. So let's assume I was being correct there. Ooh, 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 moving out of the way. I'm just, I'm just continuously firing them because they're not running out of energy. Of course, if I left it for a second, I could fire two at once like that. Boom! Oh, a whole chunk of him just fell off. These are really fun to use. I think I'll try and use this a bit more. I mean, I think I feel that lasers are probably the smarter option, but freaking explosive shards of happiness? Hell yeah. Shouldn't have fired it when I was moving so fast backwards, because they kind of just came with me. Fire again! Yay, lasers! Burn him alive! Wow, we just killed one of their biggest ships. <laughs> I'll take that, Red Faction. Stop poking me with the laser, you annoying little bugger. Go away! Also, your drones, you're already dead. Who's controlling them? I guess they are drones, but still, you get the idea. I thought that was able for me to... I thought that was able for me to pay into. I'm um, good with words, you know, so and so, so I am very... I thought... Yeah, I think it is, isn't it? But it should... Shouldn't it have, like, a little... Oop, that was weird. Like, square around it? Oh, no, 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 it doesn't. Okay. Okay. Wow, good start, then. Those are awesome! Of course, we are only versus the red faction right now. How does it do versus an asteroid? Asteroid! Oh, come on. At least, just, at least destroy this little random milk. I guess it's like a lamppost. Wow, the laser just cuts through it. That's cool. Yeah, the laser is definitely the better option. I don't think I can really argue against that. I'm kind of tempted to save up for the shield. Ah, uh, I can't. Look, look how much of a ship resource it costs. 198. That's horrible. Am I missing a smaller shield? I don't think I am, but I could possibly. <gasps> Ooh, laser drones. Really powerful laser drones. And bigger shard launchers. Oh. Ooh, that looks really cool. And so much stronger, but I like them both. And oh, I wonder if there is a way to uh, make them flip. It'd be awesome if there was. I bet there is. I bet there's a really simple way. Because if I press mirror, it does this weird ghost thing. Now, I don't know what that actually is. 
got to be perfectly honest, I have no idea what's going on with that. I'm not sure why you wouldn't be able to flip it either. Wee. Hmm. A bit of confuzzlement. Anyway, so and so it's, this will be the end of this episode. I hope you are enjoying the new faction, the new faction, yes indeed, and the new season. Uh, there will be a link in the description, like I said, to the uh, tournament videos. I really do believe they are certainly worth a look. And feel free to tell them that. Um, sorry, to tell him that Laughland sent you, because you know you may as well spread the love and the and the Lathrixian Legion to the world and all that good stuff. So thank you very much for watching. I do hope you've enjoyed. If you have, then of course, likes, favorite shares, comments, all that good stuff helps out me, helps out the channel, and ensures that reassembly continues on this channel in the future, and possibly even a tournament in the rather distant future. I am curious to see, to um, play my hand at that and see if I can do something of that ilk, as it's not really my forte, like I said before, competitive things, generally not really good at that sort of stuff. I'm a bit too laid back and um, I don't really care enough. I, I, it's, very, it's very hard for me to like, get motivated to like, be competitive. Plus, I guess though it would be different since I wouldn't be actually taking part. Look, I'm being distracted speaking at tournaments when I'm meant to be ending the video, then I get all the kills. Eh, uh, let's risk it. Okay, before we end, let's try and kill this bugger. Fire! It does so much damage! Ha! <laughs> oh crap, far too much stuff. We keep losing side thrusters. Oh, we're too tiny. Come on. I'm very carefully tapping the thruster every time I see myself look the correct way. Uh oh. Suddenly badness. Suddenly badness. No, please. Get away. Ah. Oh. Okay. Thank you again for watching. Goodbye.